Welcome! In this video, we'll cover the ability to create microsites with the Domain Mapping System plugin. This is a pro feature and not available in the free version of the plugin. If you would like more information about the pro version, including pricing and other pro features, a link is included in the description below. First, why would you want to create a microsite with the Domain Mapping System? There are a couple reasons. One, you don't have to pay for additional hosting plan. Some hosting companies charge per site. If you only need a small microsite with a different domain and a few pages, you probably don't want to pay for an additional hosting plan. With the Domain Mapping System plugin, you can avoid those extra hosting fees. Two, another reason is that it's an alternative to using multi-site. WordPress's multi-site option is very powerful and you can create multiple subsites with it. But with that power comes complexity, such as having to switch between dashboards to manage each website, as well as activating plugins and themes separately for each subsite. If you only need one or two small microsites, multi-site can be overkill. The domain mapping system is a much simpler solution. Domain mapping system can also be used as a supplement to multi-site, but we'll cover that in another video. This makes the domain mapping system plugin an excellent alternative. Now let's look at the process of building your first microsite using the Domain Mapping System plugin. For this example, I'm making a microsite about t-shirts on our main site. The primary site URL is domainmappingsystemvideo.xyz. The microsite will be located at the subdomain t-shirts.domainmappingsystemvideo.xyz, but it can be any subdomain or domain you want. Our microsite will have three pages showcasing each of the t-shirts. As you can see, I've already created the main t-shirt page and the three individual t-shirt pages. On the main t-shirt page, I've created thumbnails and headings for each of the three individual shirts. This will serve as our navigation for the microsite. Step one. In the WordPress admin, navigate to the domain mapping menu item on the left-hand menu. Step 2. Enter the alias domain for your microsite in the Enter Mapped Domain field. If you have not configured your DNS and server for the alias domain, please review the Mapping Your First Domain video or the documentation. Both are linked in the description below. Step 3. Select all the pages or posts or other published content you want within your microsite. Step 4. Choose which page you want as the microsite homepage by selecting the corresponding radio button. Step five, press save and you're set. Now visit the domain and you'll see your new microsite. If you don't get the expected results, review this guide and ensure no steps were missed. If issues persist, consult our documentation or troubleshooting guide linked in the description below. That's it. Creating a microsite with a domain mapping system plugin is that simple. 